Okay, so this is the liquid from yesterday to today and there is like five liters in here of this five liters um, probably like at least half all right is filled it's about two and a half liters that's like a decent amount of urine if you like it and it's more than probably half but based on what I see it is up to here like this it's up to here okay so half it is half half of it it is uh, it doesn't look good But when I consider the way I pass this and eventually I even got some sleep it is good That's basically what that looks like. That's a blood. For this virus, I was told it's going to be like this that I would eventually die. Uh, I must tell you that internal organs became completely, completely painful in this procedure this was just a procedure that was I'm just gonna say it's good it's good to be alive director of the home for elderly people promised me a certain death from this one and uh, I am going to tell you that based on problems that I have, other problems, lymphoma, heart problems, uh, it feels good to be the way I am. I got a few extra hours of even sleep, so I feel good. I rather feel good. Um, but I tell you that when it all started, I didn't know what to think about it. I never have anything like this because the kidneys, uh, it would be like you would squeeze them, like, like you would squeeze them completely, squeeze them, squeeze them completely. Like you squeeze, like you squeeze lemon or something like this. And it would be like rigid and painful as I would walk, I would have a tremendous pain of internal organs already by walking. Not a good stuff. But anyhow, let's see now. 12 hours. I can say I'm past this. 36 hours and I feel, yeah, I could go for a work. I feel okay. I'm okay now. Almost set.